From around midday, thousands of people began converging at Rubaga Cathedral to attend a requiem mass for the deceased musician Moses Sechibogo, more commonly known as Mose Radio. <coughs> at around half past one, a casket with radio's body arrived and it was straight away taken into the church. Mose Radio's musical partner, Douglas Mayanja, commonly known as Weasel, and his elder brother Joseph Mayanja, himself a famous musician, commonly known as Chameleon, carried a picture of the deceased as they entered church. Musicians, family members and politicians were among the people who attended the Mass. While preaching to the congregation, Father Del Gracias Caterega condemned people who were saying that radio should not be prayed for at the cathedral. He however called on celebrities to always spare time for church. Katerega warned the youths against getting involved into acts of violence and other destructive behavior. Katerega called on musicians to always care for their families. He called on people with talents to use them to improve the well-being of others. Talent is God-given. Don't own as if it's yours. Use it to serve humanity. No. Charles Peter Maiga, the Buganda Kingdom Prime Minister, said it's about time musicians started using professional managers. Our artists need professional managers. Weasel, who has been radio's musical partner for over a decade, was so overwhelmed by emotion that he could hardly speak. Other people spoke fondly of the departed artist. Tragedy teaches a few lessons. We each do not know when we shall die. Let us make the best of the short life we have on earth. Let us make best of every day and work to make the world a better place. From church, Radio's body was taken to Korolo ceremonial grounds where an overnight vigil will be held for the musician who is said to have written in his will that upon his death his life should be celebrated. <laughs> Radio will be late to rest tomorrow at Kaga in Wakiso district.